I'm going to show you how to progress the only way out mission in Dying Light 2. So it's the one where he wants you to meet the people of the bazaar. Well, you actually don't have to meet them at all. I'm not sure what the trigger is exactly, but I can just explain to you guys what I did to make it go. So I actually immediately ran off and didn't do it. And then I came back later and there was one person I talked to and did a quest. I don't know if I even needed to do that. I have a feeling it might just be a time-based thing or certain interactions or thing. I'm not, not entirely sure, but what I did was I ran off and got random windmills. I, I looted some stuff. I would come back to this place to sleep because I was trying to test something else. So go here and sleep like until morning and then till night and vice versa. And then go and do random stuff and then come back and sleep and just do that like a few times and see if that'll like, you know, get him to progress. Because I literally just ran and did random stuff, came in, did one quest for one guy, which uh, was the guy who was, he was obsessed. He had to make an invention or something like that. He's like one of the first guys you come, you walk in and you turn to your right. He's on your right somewhere. Uh, I don't know if I even need to do that. It, it really might just be go there and sleep and then go and do random stuff and then go there and sleep. That's literally all I did. I did I didn't I didn't even finish that mission. I literally just gave the guy the parts and then just left. I never even I never even finished the mission. I actually still probably have it up in the journal somewhere. Yeah, Spark and Adventure. I literally didn't even turn on his device. I gave him some parts and he told me to go to the device and I was like, no, I'm good, and I just left. And, uh, and then I came back later to go there, slept, because I was trying to test resetting how resetting spawns works. And went there and slept and then left and it just popped up on my way back the that, you know, I, it, I'm done and I can meet Hakam now. So if you are having trouble getting this quest to progress so that you can go ahead and go on the main story, like I said, just try leaving, try finding a few windmills or something, go back there and sleep and then leave and go do something and then just go back there and sleep. There's a bed on the second floor. Like you walk in, just go up the stairs and it's to your left. There's a bed and you can just go sleep there and just go sleep there, leave and just go do something in the city and then come back and do that. And see if that will trigger it, because that's what triggered it for me. And like I said, you can also try doing the inventor guy mission if you want, um, but I didn't even finish it. I just gave him some parts and quit. So hopefully this helps you out. You can try troubleshooting with what I just said and what got it to work for me. And hopefully this will work for you too. If you can't get that quest to progress and you are just hard, like you know, soft locked in the game basically and can't progress the story, try doing that. Leave, go do stuff, come back, sleep there, and then leave, do stuff, come back, sleep there, and repeat that process for a while and then see if it'll make the mission progress and you can meet Hakam.